Dear students, in this era of technological revolution and with a great boom in the field of information technology, knowledge of computers becomes very essential for students. Keeping this in mind and with a view to spreading computer literacy among our very young students, we are pleased to start introduction to computers. So dear students, from today we are going to start the first lesson of introduction to computers and today's topic is a computer. Dear students, first we will see the physical and mental effort. Any work that we do with our hands or legs is called physical effort. At home we use many machines to reduce our physical effort. Machines like the iron, geyser, mixer, vacuum cleaner and washing machine save our time and energy. They help us do the work quickly and easily. Any work that is challenging to the brain is called mental effort. In school or at home, you do sums, learn poems by heart, memorize dates and events in history and learn geography and science. This needs a lot of mental effort. Even those who work in shops, banks and offices have to do some work that needs a lot of mental effort. And so we use machines that will help us to reduce our mental effort. Machines like calculators and computers help us to do our work easily, quickly and without any mistakes. Let's see the definition of computer. Dear students, do you know what is a computer? A computer is an electronic machine which is made up of different parts like the keyboard, mouse, CPU box, monitor and printer. Dear students, a computer is used to write, draw, do sums, play games, listen to music and watch videos. It works very fast. It does not make mistakes. It makes our work very easy. It can remember many things. It reduces our physical and mental effort. So dear students, in this video we have learned about physical and mental effort and also we have learned the definition of computer. In next video we will see the functions of a computer. So watch the video carefully and understand the lesson.